I'm Robin Stosky. I'm at three and a half, I was diagnosed with cerebral palsy and due to complications there afterwards from vaccines, I um, su suffered a traumatic brain injury. Um, tell me a little bit about how that affects your everyday. Um, well, I control my disability. My disability doesn't control me, so I basically see it as a, a, a limitation that I've learned to live with. Um, I see that when you ambulate, you're using a single point cane. Tell me a little bit about that. Is that always the way it was, or have you progressed uh, to that? No, actually, um, up until um, recently, um, about three years ago, I mostly was a complete wheelchair user. Rehabilitation is not only stepping into a physical therapy clinic, but it is also a lifestyle. So tell me a little bit about your gait before you started doing the functional electronic stimulation. Uh, before I started the electronic stimulation, um, my gait was uh, pretty much all over the place in which um, my muscles were um, firing before my brain and my brain was firing before my muscles. Now were you able to walk with a uh, single point cane without that prior to using the FES? Um, for a sh short distance but not with the endurance or with the, pa uh, with the gait pattern in which I had. It made a huge impact in um, the outcome of um, giving me the freedom of and the abilities to do what I do today in a greater measure and I will um, one, th one of the greatest rewards that I have seen from it is that a lot of people take from, for granted the ability to have your hands free on a daily basis to do the things you need to do in the workplace and at home. I love my rehouse gym.